Thanks everybody for tuning in here to Jazz Memes. John's story here again. I had a question about rhythm changes. Uh, not a chord melody question, but more of an outlining chord melody question. So let's just talk about two of the main types of rhythm changes, right? Over the classic song, I've Got Rhythm by George Gershwin. We have the one to six, two, five, three, six, two, five. We also have one with the passing diminished. One, flat two diminished. So if I were to arpeggiate each of these, the one, six, two, five sounds like this. Right? If I do one to six dominant, two minor, five dominant, one. So our first step when really outlining any chord changes is to break down the chords we're playing and to arpeggiate each one of them. But uh, Jerry Coker, who wrote a book called Patterns for Jazz Improvisation, he talked about something called change running. And change running is where we want to be outlining the chord changes using our arpeggios, but creating contours. So we're going up one chord and down another. It kind of sounds like this. Or another one. kind of a way to create sort of a flow like we have in bebop. So if you're trying to practice rhythm changes, I would suggest practice two sets of chord changes on this A. Again, one that's one, six, either six minor or six dominant, two, five, three, six, two, five, as the starting part of the A section, or one, diminished, two, another diminished, three, six, two, five, one. Play those again. Option A. One, two, three. Option B. Try that again. Let's do it a little slower. Option A. Ready, go. A one to the six chord, to the two chord, five, three chord, six, diminished. One, flat two diminished. Two, flat three diminished. Three, six, two, five. Okay, now I'm going to outline it using some change running. First one. I use a flat nine there on that G7 too. Um, and here's a here's some change running with the passing diminished. That's a very famous riff, right, that we've heard in jazz before. How about at this tempo, I'm going to do a little soloing over these first eight bars of the rhythm changes, okay? And I want you to listen back and see if you can hear if I'm outlining either the one that starts with the passing diminished or the one that starts with the one to the six to the two five. Mm -hmm. Two, A section on rhythm changes. <laughs> Another one. 
guitar player, when I play lines like this, I instantly think Charlie Christian, um, who was, of course, our founding father on this instrument, really, next to guys like George Barnes and Les Paul, one of the first electric guitarists. And listen to some of his solos in Benny Goodman's band, like on a tune like Airmail Special, because he's doing a lot of that. He's straight up outlining these chords, but alternating going up and down through each one. So if I were you and I wanted to practice some A section of rhythm changes, I would set aside both of those chord progressions. I would arpeggiate each of those chords, and then I would try some change running where I arpeggiate up and then down through each of those chords that pass by. So if you got newer questions, comment, like, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for tuning in here to Jazz Memes.